Inquiry-based learning is an educational strategy uh, where the student follows a scientific method in order to develop uh, a knowledge. Students become uh, active participants in the learning process. The inquiry means a kind of quest for information and students do some research and they follow practices similar to those uh, conducted by professional uh, scientists. First of all, um, the student has an hypothesis, so he has to develop an experiment in order to check that uh, hypothesis. So the role of the teacher is mostly to be like a guide and help the student construct the knowledge through building an experiment and then checking whether the results uh, are okay for the hypothesis that the student previously developed. In one of my learning scenarios, I used a guided inquiry. I encouraged my students to search for some information concerning some famous painters whose works uh, they had found in the Europeana collection. Uh, what was very important here uh, is that uh, students were learning while providing knowledge. So we were not only receivers of knowledge, but also uh, providers of knowledge. There are many benefits uh, when you incorporate inquiry-based learning in your lessons and for me uh, one of the main advantages of incorporating digital cultural content such as the one that you can find in Europeana into my math lessons is that um, they make the lesson more appealing for the student because they somehow contextualize better what they are doing. You can find a lot of learning scenarios connected with um, the approach of inquiry-based learning and the topic of cultural heritage on the teaching with European blog. Go to the blog, click on the learning scenarios tab and filter for inquiry-based learning. If you are willing to learn more about inquiry-based learning, I strongly recommend the European in your classroom MOOCs. By participating in the MOOC, you can learn how to implement inquiry-based learning approach in your classroom and how to link it to the European resources. The MOOCs uh, will start in 2020 and will be available in five languages uh, – English, Spanish, Portuguese, Italian and French. So just go to europeanschoolnetacademy.eu and register. You can do it now.